Hi, welcome to Kachai with Lucky. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel that is Kachai with Lucky so that you can be part of the family. I am back, of course, with the team, uh, Brian Semanda, sex therapist, Thank Ashlyn you. Mobiru, people management consultant. Thank and you. today's conversation is very, very important because, again, uh, we look through our mail and every single day you hear of a man struggling with masturbation, mm -hmm. addiction, and you have also <laughs> women, I've, I've got from women who are saying, I can't even seem to have normal sex with my partner because I seem to be addicted to masturbation. So today yeah, yeah. we want to look at how they can deal with this challenge. And Brian, you being the expert mm. <laughs> on this particular topic, um, we'll let you take the lead. That's a, that's a beautiful thing. Uh, you see, most of the problems I always interfere with people that have these sexual issues. Mm. The issue is not the sexual problem, but right. what it comes along with and how you fail to manage it. I have. I'm one people, who, one person who goes like contra, you know, controversial on such topics. Mm. Masturbation is not entirely bad. It's not entire. It's one of the reasons why you can actually relate with yourself, know yourself, know your body. I tell some girls, you can never know yourself unless you start, you know, trusting yourself to figure out what works for you. Sometimes, not all the time, because there are women who say, "Me, I don't know what works for me. I just put there and the guy does whatever he does." Mm. But I actually found myself first time when I masturbated. But right. for men, the problem is there's a, sci a lot of science to masturbation. Most people there's science? Mm. A lot of science to it, meanwhile. The, si the, the science to it, in, in as much as men are concerned, is every time you masturbate, it's either there's a lot of mineral hormonal depots that you lose in the process of masturbating. Mm. Right. And no one masturbates for one, once, or just today, after six months. Mm. Most people that masturbate, you're going to do more than three times a day, just limiting it and knowing how do I do it. Mm. You see, the, 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 the science to it is every time you ejaculate or release, you're losing a lot of zinc, you're using a lot of good hormones, endorphin, mm. dopamine, which are responsible you're for your happiness. You're wasting, actually, the word is... Mm. You're wasting. A lot and of in waste. wasting, you're not replenishing. So mm. that means you, you, you're going to have a lot of emotional relationship problems. You mm. can relate because you're stressed. Most of these hormones are responsible for your stress and in the end result with your guy downstairs. You're lowering your testosterone production, you know? Mm -hmm. That means you're not going to be able to engage sexually with the right partner. Right. And then over time, I've seen people actually damaging. There's a nicer way to masturbate. People just use a lot of energy. And then after that... You say you must a nice way of masturbating. There's a nice okay, way. Okay, so there's and a bad way of masturbating yes. and then there's a better way. First of all, explain what yeah. is the bad way in which a person can masturbate uh -huh. and how can they correct it to a I don't know if there's way. anything like that to yeah. masturbate. No, but, but then to yeah. also understand mm -hmm. how does somebody get to start masturbating? What causes Is this that? masturbation? Yeah, there, there are three things like, okay, there's young people who start because they learned how to do it from school or something, you know, it's very nice. 90% 90, 90 <laughs> of men, most, most boys will start most, with masturbation. Most boys, we start with that mm. to get into knowing yourself. I mean, you know it, there's nothing was beautiful. The first time I did it, like when I was young, mm. there was nothing beautiful like seeing something coming out. <laughs> like, oh was it out of curiosity? Out of, I saw it at school. You know, right. you're in school, you're in senior one, and mm. the senior four guy is doing and stuff is coming out of it. Like, I mean, mm. you went first senior and it failed because I was young, I was 13. Mm. It failed, <laughs> then, then 14, <laughs> at 14 <laughs> senior two, <laughs> it came out nice. I was like, oh, so it was fun. Okay. And then it became a problem. <laughs> it became a problem because I couldn't, sometimes you will escape out of school to go do it. Mm -hmm. Of class, the teacher is teaching something you don't understand, you just jump out, zoop. So you're saying it could also have a psychological exactly. effect on the young boys who actually they do. do it. You know, you can't concentrate at school. It right. loses, your concentration loses it, but most people never understand. Because mm -hmm. now you have become an addict. An addict. Mm -hmm. But okay, the bad problem, the problem here is, masturbation, all it brings, whatever it brings, comes back to your end result. I wouldn't say it's a problem, but what it comes along with. Mm. I told you, you find someone who's very uncoordinated. Mm. They are stressed over it. And I told you, every time you release or exaculate, you're losing zinc, selenium, copper. These mm. are very responsible for your brain work. Right. Even your emotional, you, you think everyone is seeing you. You become cautious. Shame. You become mm. so cautious that everyone everywhere. is seeing mm. you. So that's the problem. Mm. Now, you fail to even relate with girls. You can't. You don't want. There's a guy who actually said, I saw this in senior two, and then they forced me to marry at after university. Mm -hmm. Man, sometimes I love to get out of the bedroom to do to my, to, my, to do my thing, and then I got to the point where I'm tired. I do it in our presence. Okay, so we have most young men, and uh -huh. when you speak to men, they will tell you, as a young boy, I did experiment with masturbation. Yeah, yeah. Now we need to understand why is it that some boys have tried it and managed to get off, off it, it. Uh -huh. and others, others remain addicted. 
how do these young boys, because boys are still doing it in school, how do they do it mm. if they are going to experiment with it and not get addicted to it and move away from it? You see, me when I'm dealing with addicts, I don't deal with the problem that they're going through. I mm. deal with what it can cause and how you can get better out of it. Right. You see, what it causes is always a problem. Because most people are like, you see, you know what, what happens every time you enter a girl and you come in one minute or seconds, Mm. Most people that masturbate actually have a lot of wet dreams because their muscles cannot hold. But we are talking about boys who have not even started seeing girls. See, exactly. They are just They're doing all... them in their dormitories yeah, or wherever they Yeah, that's what I'm do. saying. Is yeah. as I'm, I'm telling them, mm. you start doing it now, you're going to grow and you'll never be able to do that. Ah, to okay. Be, do it. And the other thing is the muscle gets, gets weaker or, or sicker. You get sick, the thing can even get a stronger erection as you grow older. Ah, so you might get uh, those You're getting issues, the physiological yeah, issues now. Mm. You see, even a stronger erection becomes painful. Oh yeah? It yeah, becomes painful mm. because you've been using to a lot of energy and they, they use the wrong things now. At mm. school they used to use soap because it's more slippery. Mm, that's what and they say, you get, you get yeah. soap. Uh -huh, and, the and soap, and the, you see... There's a type of soap that I didn't want to get for, for, for advertising sake. <laughs> yes. But they would say, get that soap and then you'll get and things the sorted. And the problem is most people think as mm. you're doing your rolling, you're rolling, you're thinking you're going to bring out. But in the process of you rolling, you're intaking. Most of the time, after you that you must have been feel a bit of itchy and irritation in mm, there. Mm. The soap has been going inside you. Right, which will cause more, more complications. More problems. For and you. then you get a place where you, you, your erection starts being weak, weak and shrinking. Meanwhile, you're young. You're young. Mm -hmm. So you go, you go to a level you don't even want women. Mm. Uh, when you are, that's why most people just get addicted and they can't control it because the sweetness it creates. Right. So me, when I'm dealing with addicts that come to me about this, no masturbation, like I, from experience, I'll tell her, you know, tell them, you know. It's not the It problem. can still be hard because exactly. yes. yeah. 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 that's why I said it's them. Mm. When, when you start it, look at the outcome. Most of the time, don't look at how sweet it is. Look at the outcome of it. You're going to get a place where your sexuality loses meaning with other people. Mm. It can only be understood by you. And it becomes a problem because you're conscious someone knows. That's funny. Like sometimes you finish your thing and you're like, someone You start see looking me. around. Did someone see me? So the thing is, there's a friend of mine who, who used to do it in class. He would find a way of cleaning the putting his legs together, and they will start shaking. And everyone like, doesn't know in yeah. class. So the problems are the things you do with it. So how you come back to a place of knowing, OK, if I have done this, what is the problem? Before mm -hmm. you know that the weakness of the erection and then the sickness it creates, it brings and a lot of anxiety. And then the mental. Yeah, it brings a lot of anxiety. Mm -hmm. Your stress levels are high. You become irritable. You become like, I, I mean, it's easily annoyed. You can't relate with people. Relationships. All the signs like yeah. of other you, addictions. You, you start even. having problems with your partner. So mm. the thing is, that's where I start from. Do you want your your marriage? This is what you're gonna do. Now, how do you overcome masturbation is a mm. key thing. Because masturbation is not something you overcome in one week. Mm. That's a lie. You can actually take a month or two without doing it and then before you know it, you're like, oops. You relapse. That's what I call relapsing relapse. mm. addiction. But the thing is, mm. you should learn to take it in a better way. I, I tell them every addiction has something good in it. The good in it is how it makes you feel. But then, how do you learn to use it for a positive? So, masturbation can help those young men or men who can pick, who don't even control their hair, that they, they, they are like, they come. How? Right, right, in one minute, I'm done. So, this is how you start. When you're doing your masturbation, make it fun in a way that you don't want to use like hard stuff. Just do more sensual with yourself. But if you're making it fun, no, aren't you I'm now saying, building well, on the addiction? You now, I'm teaching you how to make it look like it's not a problem. Because, ah yeah, yeah because, because one, yeah. one thing uh -huh. i notice most people think mm -hmm. masturbation is bad exactly. it's evil even it's evil uh -huh. yeah. but masturbation is not evil when it gets to being addictive that's where the problem that are. is when now you have to get into a reality mm -hmm. check mm -hmm. and say yeah. okay do i really need this and mm -hmm. what is bringing me to this point right because if you do not notice how did I get here? Yeah. Mm. And how would I want to get away from? Then you'll start struggling. And because of the feel-good effect, the endorphins that you produce, mm. they are going to make you feel that I do not need a man, I do not need a woman. So, I can yeah. finish it. That's why they say, uh, I, 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 I am my own. Uh, yeah, but then you have to realize that a relationship, people tend to forget, relationship is not about just sex. Exactly. And if a relationship is not about just sex, even being addicted to masturbation is the going to affect the entire yeah. relationship yes. on how to relate. I, <laughs> there's a time a friend of mine called me and said, lucky you will not believe what I found at work today. And this is my fellow workmate. I'm mm -hmm. like, hey, what's going on? Hey, I found you must Moody. have got hey. on, on a PC. Yeah. Yeah, imagine, mm -hmm. at a workplace. You know, it's right. So it has gotten to this point. This is a, a respectable man of a certain age 
married with children, masturbating at work. Yeah. Now you, oh yes. Because they have relapsed. And, and he I'm, was watching I'm thinking. these things. He's watching this because exactly. masturbation and pornography. Uh, they do porn, not. I think they, 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 they're not so separate. They are not so separate because that you you fail. You you start thinking. You put an imagination of somebody is there. Mm. Now having an image of two people doing it, you find yourself in the process of. Uh, haven't of, you ever met people who look at you, especially men, and they're like, hey, for you I finished." I mean, <laughs> For you, I finished, but the guy has never met you before. Eh? They even send you. They're stalkers. Uh, they will send exactly. you messages. Like, they will tell you, please, may I have, may I have a picture of you? And you're like, for what? They but they you know, go you're, you're very good. Down. I, I uh -huh. like you. So if you don't give them, uh, that's they, why your pictures on Facebook, <laughs> on, 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 even on status, uh -huh. they, if they have your contact and they can access your status, the pictures uh -huh. that we post, they, they save. undress you. They undress and then they start picture? undressing you and, and then, then masturbate. They, but this friend of mine said, I no longer watch porn. I've watched a lot of it, so I just keep downloading. Keep downloading. So I don't want to watch. But the idea. To is, download what? Download From his head. Whatever. whatever. He, he never hey. wants to watch. Actually, he doesn't he said, need to. He said, he said, to him, he said, I don't really want to look at my wife's PJ because it, just, it doesn't tell me anything. Mm -hmm. I just have to replay what I know in my head and I'll get there. So the idea is every girl or man who is masturbating, they have troubles. Like you said, relationship troubles. Yes. They're emotionally very, very unstable because of whatever it creates. They get withdrawn. They, they, they get withdrawn, yeah. They are stressed more, so the problems are coming in. Now, a young man or young woman out there who wants to get the best of it, how do I come out of it? And how do I deal with get the, the mm. after effects? And if this lady at all, your husband masturbates and you're looking at it as a problem, attack. Start being there together, help him. Do together so that you get in touch now. Uh, but uh, Brian, you're saying that uh -huh. it's not like everyone is into it's into what you're into. Yes. Yeah. Sex is a very individual thing and people mm -hmm. need to understand this. That is why you'll find people will tell you, I can never go down to like what's that? It's evil. Yeah. And you can't tell them, No, you're not good enough. You're not yeah. That's not But them. that's who they are. They are not even going to get that place. So to, to ask somebody me personally, I wouldn't like to watch that mm -hmm. and um, take. No, <laughs> no I, and that's just an individual thing. That doesn't work for me. Mm -hmm. It works for you. So you have to realize that these things have to be individual. Indiv if your partner, yes, does that, but I'm not interested. Like How do I help him? You see, there's, a, there's this lady who said uh, they were together. Like this guy, the moment, the moment he enters, he has come. And then over time, I also met another partner where the girl is the problem. The moment she has come, huh? mm -hmm. like quickly, she has come. She doesn't want to be touched like, Brian, I just want more. The girl doesn't want to be touched. Mm. Now she said, Brian, me, while, while he's doing this thing, I'm masturbating. So I come quickly. I don't want nothing to do. So how masturbation becomes good for you, both men and women, is learning how to transpose your cum or your orgasm. How do you transpose that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm willing to listen. The transposition <laughs> is a pattern. Now, the for, for guys, if you are, have issues with coming quickly, start. Start with your masturbation. Make it fun. When you realize you're about to get there, take a deep breath and hold it there when there's somebody and, or there's yeah, nobody you are, you because you're, not, you're, you're, you're practicing on you He's alone a therapist, yeah. you're practicing yourself because mm. most men who come quick they get excited easily. oh so you're saying you try to masturbate before you actually go with your partner not, so really, not can, on that day you just can previous practice. To practice that's what i'm saying like how you go to gym and, and do your thing uh -huh. now you're going to use masturbation as your big benchmark to help you last longer there how mm -hmm. when you realize it's about to come you know when it's about when you're doing your thing, yeah, you, uh, when you realize it's about when you start transposing and then you breathe in, breathe, breathe in out. and out, like a deep breath and then hold down, and you keep on breathing like at, at a rate, mm. it goes down. Mm -hmm. Remember, in that place, sometimes you can drop a little, but the erection stays there. The difference is when you must have breathing and finish everything there, the guy goes down also. Mm -hmm. So, when you just little a little goes out, and then you hold the other, the, the erection stays stronger. Now, when you go back to, to, mom, your, partner. to your partner, you're mm. going to use the same technique you're using to control. It's about control. Mm. The same thing with the women. If you realize it's about to come, be like get a, get a distraction. Uh, sometimes you can get. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes you don't want to get a distraction. <laughs> you just want to go oh, because <laughs> because it's fun. You find it in a while. Exactly. Oh. You better hit it, it and uh, that's it. <laughs> yeah. If you have no problem with multiples, it's okay. Mm. There are women who just that one thing is enough for me. I don't want to be touched. Mm. I guess it's irritating. Mm. So if you have problems with multiples, that's when you start practicing. But masturbation, you should make it a way that it's not just a scene. 
learn your body through masturbation, but don't become a like don't use it as, so, a, as, as, as a, a problem. Now, what if we're talking to people who uh -huh. have not masturbated uh -huh. yet uh -huh. and they don't want to get to that place? Yes, I, I want I want us to address those people. Exactly. How do I avoid you know avoid getting into because it's not easy. To when you know what when you know what problems it causes like, mm. I, like i told you me i don't attack the problem i mm. create a story side of like hey you know when you start the effects of, the it. Effects of it mm. look at them and then you're like uh -uh, i don't want to get there I, but i better come here so the thing is most men think that i masturbate because i don't have a woman mm. i have a problem with people that have been in dubai like those arab countries they say mm. brian Man, I've been here for two years, no woman. Mm. The only thing I do is me and me. Mm. And by the time they are back, their thing is very small and mini, and they can't even. So can you get? Can, you can get they get it back? back? back or the effects no, are permanent? No sex problems can't be solved. Mm. That one I'm very sure. The only problem is the time it's going to take. Mm. Now, in during during the pro, the, the, the time, and whether of, or not your partner will be that patient exactly. to wait for you to so overcome. That means you need to address it from a place of understanding. Meanwhile, there's no problem. Accept, I mean, telling your partner, mm. you know what, this is what the shit yeah, is that going. that conversation is, is very key. Important. And then, and, and ah, you you, you uh, also need to to know uh -huh. who are you bringing that conversation to mm. are they ready to listen, listen. and help you get mm -hmm. out of it mm -hmm. or are they going to make it an issue why you have not been giving them that level of satisfaction they are mm -hmm. looking for mm -hmm. because sometimes i'm thinking masturbation if you totally do not even want to go into that space mm. do not think about it i mean i wouldn't want to say that I have not gone through it, mm. but I don't remember ever going through it. Yeah. Whatever, oh, yes. if it has happened, like it's, it's by it, default. It's by default. Uh, like what happened? Or uh -huh, maybe uh -huh. we were in the process, and then it and, got and, over, and, and then I had yeah, yeah. to, you mm -hmm. know. Mm -hmm. But the whole effect is because you're thinking so much about it. The mind registers it and stores it and says, "One day I'm mm -hmm. going to do it." So making yourself busy away from the thought. And knowing that at the end of it all, it's going to affect your relationship. Let's work through it. I had a conversation I was telling you with a mm. friend of mine. Yeah. And he was telling me how to get off it. You, eat, you have to eat enough genuts. To, yeah, to do I, I don't know what that is. Uh -huh. what enough to enough ginats because they, they are going water, to make they are going to give you water. enough water, and yeah. then you need to take your enough mind palm, away yeah, enough, from women yeah. mm -hmm. or men. Mm -hmm. So that when you get to a woman, when you get to a man, you're able to release Enough. and have a good time with this person. Mm -hmm. I think we are, we are also forgetting to discuss the mental aspect of it. Yes, yeah. There's you who is addicted to it, uh -huh. and there's me, your partner. Mm -hmm. Now, I see me getting to a place of understanding how, why do you find yourself attractive and you don't find me attractive? Because exactly. people struggle with that a lot. It's like, my partner, this, this woman was saying me, lucky. My partner masturbates, he can't satisfy me. I don't know if I'm not attractive to him. He goes and does his things. For me, I'm not getting anything. How do you engage a conversation with your partner who doesn't even understand why you're like that? Because you're not the only one who is hurting. She's hurting in this. But how do you involve her in this and get her to a place of understanding you? First, yeah. first before Brian, you come in, women need to know. They should never blame themselves for a mature person's acts. Exactly. Mm. Because at the end of the day, they have chosen what they are doing. Right. When you start looking for fault within you, mm -hmm. and yet it is not you who is actually going through that act, yeah. then you're going to beat yourself so hard Over until you it. start hating this yeah, person this that man. even when they come to you to discuss with you, you've already created a mind of hate. Mm. So they should not think, oh, maybe I'm not attractive to him. Hey, he married you. So one so time so you are attractive so and he loves you. But mm. there's something that he's struggling with. Yes. Which you're also struggling with. Which you're with. struggling yes. with. It's, it's a double portion. Now, you mm. see what happens? Most of the times I tell you, when you have what you call a problem, don't look at it as a problem. Right. Because this, okay, you have a, a different story. My other story was, mm. this girl comes into the brain. This guy, he can't get an erection when we're having sex. But he has an erection when, when you're done. Time. No, mm. when he's when masturbation he's time. And he says, right, I don't know. Like, okay, he says, he stays on the bed. And he does, he touches himself and he gets... And you're there. And you're there. Okay. And, I, and, and then, but by, by, by the time <laughs> he is about to, to think about me, the yeah. thing is not there. So this is what I told her. Mm. Bring the guy out, like, when you get your erection, right. he says, me, me doing masturbation, I get the erection. By the moment I see that, I, I don't even... It, it just it. disappears. Disappears. So I told him, just engage now, this is time. Let the girl do. 
If she's interested, if she's, exactly. Exactly. Thank you. Hey. Hey. Uh -uh. I will look now, at you with your. Hey, this is where we are coming. Hey. She's a married person. She brought the guy to me with a problem, and the guy openly said, "You know what? Mm. I have no. I don't know why, but mm. me when I'm doing my stuff, it's there. But when it's about to enter." I don't know where the, the thing is. So it's you want a woman to help you masturbate no, no, for you to get to a point? And when you're outside, uh -huh. like I'm here get with my... Get, get so much sensual in his linger area. Get to know the body pattern of the other. By the way, it's not that they are, they, they are, they are all... Uh, Do you notice? Let me, let me, I'm thinking, uh, by the time I'm helping you, mm -hmm. your mind is already telling you I'm going to come. Uh, now, this is what happens. In the uh, process of you doing whatever it is, I tell you, you are going to be in charge of the sex. Uh, when you realize it's up there, sit on it and roll. But the problem in the hmm. first week... What if sitting on it and rolling <laughs> and in the best position? Exactly. Is what I'm when, you're solving, when you're solving a problem, look huh? for every possibility, solution to it. Because hmm. this guy says, me, I have erections even when he's not sex, hmm. sex time. Can but you work. can't, you can't yeah. for whatever yeah. reason. I can be at work and have an erection. Hmm. I mean, well, they're just newly married. This is just She didn't... Give up. And, well, and, she and didn't know she, about the problem. A, no, she's a beautiful woman. And mm. like, you look at this beautiful. Do you want her to cheat? Mm. Like, because you know it's a problem. Now, when you look at the problem, see the end result of it. You want to lose a woman because you're masturbating? Like, no, I don't want, I don't want to think about it. It's like, okay, now start helping each other. Mm. The moment you have your erection, and then sex is an intentional thing. I am telling people, the, the, the erection you use for masturbation is not the erection you need to penetrate the other Yes. Mm. The erection for masturbation, when you masturbate... It's a lot of energy required. Yeah. Sometimes it's actually like a weak thing for you, you're just doing whatever mm. it's there. You can produce, or you, you can, but the thing is we pick every addict. Mm. If you've been an addict before, for whatever it is, you can be addicted to your phone, you can mm. be addicted, you're addicted to food. Mm. Every time you look at it and run away from it, that's where the problems are. You start missing it. But I think, like you, you said you before, uh -huh. for me when I talk to people who are addicted to uh -huh. anything, it could be alcohol, it could uh -huh. be... Why don't you think about the people around you? It's because like, most, in most cases, while you're fighting addiction, you need something to motivate you. Once you know how much you're losing and what you're losing and what it means to you, I think that's motivation enough for you to want to work your, on yourself. Because once you are addicted, Brian, if you're not ready to get rid of ma masturbation, yes. you're not going not. to. Your brain will Even not in your you marriage, you're going to mental. move with it. It's mental. So unless your partner has gotten to a place where they feel... It is a problem, mm -hmm. regardless, you can scream, you can shout, you don't satisfy me, throw tantrums, that person will not change. So exactly. again, you have to really look at it, get a third person yeah, exactly. so to deal with it. That's where a therapy, sex there's, therapy there's this comes in. Came to say, Brian, I mean, I've been with my husband, but let's, let him be aware. I think about something and I'm super wet. Mm -hmm. I touch myself and like, everything was so, so I'm like, okay, let's bring back to the place. Mm. Imagine he's not here when you are on together. Because sex is, is something you have to create a story around. Me, I have a story I created. Mm. The story is... What's is, your story? You can share so that people can use the story. <laughs> I, I, yes. I, I created a story because I realized most of the time why people, some people can't quickly win yet and the masturbation is because you're concentrating on what you're doing. Mm. So me, I created a story that is beautiful and it's a journey story. Mm. Like, this, I can tell this story for two hours. You know, I know you've been thinking about what I'm doing. Mm. Just when I said, oh... There. So you're talking or telling me? You're talking a story. and and I'm and and we are. I'm, I'm uh, not sure I want to hear stories. Uh, <laughs> this, this is what I'm saying. You learn stories for two you hours. Learn, you're busy. You learn, what are you doing in two hours? hours. What's that? You learn, you learn your partner and uh, you know the kind of exactly. Kind of this is exactly. What I'm about. So mm. The issue is if you're solving a problem related to sex, mainly if it's an addiction, mm. get it from the other help. Seek for help. The help mm. is from your partner because they must. If your partner doesn't understand your problem, that's where things come. As, like, that's when you let get me, a therapist. Let, let, let me exactly. tell you, you party this thing is like this thing is like marriage. Yeah. Huh? Mm. As much as your husband is beating you, and giving you all sorts of insecurities, mm. for as long as it has not entered your head, I need to get out of this marriage. Mm. Even if your friends tell you get out, you can get a life die. out there. You're going to die, mm. unless it registers in your mind that this is wrong. Even the sex therapists won't help what much. Mm. All that information will come in, mm. but it has to take you. Because you, the, when you started, it was between you and your mind mm. that I want to do this. Mm. So the moment you say, now I want to let go, listen to everybody. But at the time that you're ready to set and go is when you... Because 
you will say i talked to him I, but he is not changing uh, it is not his time no, see, she is not ready to uh, stop the masturbation why you seek a third person or a therapist it's not because it's no it's going to go away it is very important in most cases i could be doing something but i don't know how it's affecting you exactly you know? and you're not able to express yourself as a hard person because of the relationship or the strain that we have between us but if brian just sits there and you talk and he listens to me and i talk if i express myself there in front of a third that's why they have therapists mm. you will understand my pain more and you will even be shocked that this is what i've been doing to ashley i didn't know that so that is why even seeing a third party does not necessarily mean that you're gonna get why you're like that but it will make you look around you and see how much and be accountable for it. But that needs a third party because yes. me and you will be fighting. It's, ah, it's the same the thing. Yes. Yeah, you, because you didn't do uh -huh. this. You, didn't do that. you know, you are not always there. So uh -huh. I have to, you, you will keep throwing uh -huh. blame onto uh -huh. each uh -huh. other. Uh -huh. So the third party, the therapist uh -huh. comes in to, uh -huh. to so make, uh, give a clear picture uh -huh. of the What's effects each and every one of you is getting. But like I said, still, uh -huh register it in your mind you want to stop you want help okay you want now, help as we conclude because yeah. we are pressed for time yeah. where do people who have uh, this kind of problem because masturbation addiction is not something people freely express exactly. especially in our it, country it, it looks we like talk about when i posted it scary. on one of my pages people are like masturbation is evil jesus never hey, hey, they start, they start quoting it becomes the Bible. religious but it's a problem that is affecting our society. Yeah. Where do people go if they need help? This Brian, is, this is what would you be knowing how did you... Uh, you uh, see, yeah. uh, when, when these things happen to you as a person, sometimes you think you're the most evil person. Mm. The thing is, accept that you have a problem. Must but where do I go to get help? To talk to somebody you, who has you gone through... A therapist who knows the problem. Most people mm. go to these singers and coaches who sell medicine. I've had people lie to people that there is medicine they can give you to stop masturbation. You mm. see? If you have used masturbation, mm. come for this medicine. You see that? That is not there. Mm. Even when the, the sexual problems that it creates mm. are much more physiological and psychological more than just... Okay, thank you. So for clarity's mind. sake, uh, if somebody wanted to come to you and they have uh, no masturbation yes. issues, do you think you can be able to I, help? This is what I deal with. Where do they go to find you? That's what I was trying to oh, get yeah. to. Uh, yeah. Rohan Samanda. Mm. I am uh, on, on, on Instagram and, and, and Facebook, but also my office is in Tanza. I have a therapy center. Slowly, could you this. maybe tell us slowly where your office is and my where they come? My office is in Tanza, mm -hmm. near Prime Petrol Station. Mm. And my cell phone number is always in the... In the, in the, in the but you can, you can give them slowly again? My cell Sex problems are solved at all. Well, thank you so much. That's all we had for you on Kachai with Lucky Like Your Heart. You can contact Brian Semanda for your masturbation problems and addictions. I'm sure he'll be able to all help. Or any other business. But remember, uh, your mind. <laughs> your mind is uh -huh. key. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Kachai with Lucky, so that you can be part of the family. May God bless you. Be kind to one another. Kwaheri.